So I decided to go on MySpace and put up a profile. I said I wanted someone who was intelligent with dreamy eyes and a beard. And I got a hit from Liza Minnelli. So I decided I better put a picture up there so they know what they're getting. And now I get a lot of spam for mortuaries. And I got, even got an offer for free restorative taxidermy. But I love senior romance, I do. It's so relaxing. I mean, I know what you're all wondering, and yes, you can after 70, but carefully. <laughs> it's sort of like the horizontal two-step. You know, one, two. <laughs> and it's over. It's really nice because most men my age are so are so old that they fall asleep before they they I got that mixed up. They fall asleep before they get it. They they can't see what they're getting and they fall asleep before they get it. That's it. But anyway, <laughs> it was a good one and I wanted to do it. Yeah. They all have they all have replaced hips and arthritic joints. So when they really start moving, it's like it sounds like a dress rehearsal for stomp. But you don't have to worry about meeting their parents. <laughs> Guy called me up and he said, I want you to meet my mother. And he came over with a shovel. <laughs> Another guy called me up and he said, boy, where do you see my package? Where do you see my package? And it was immense. It was immense. It had a respirator. <laughs> it had an insulin pump. And it had a holster. I said, where's the gun? He says, it backfires. I said, well, don't we all? <laughs> you know, uh, vocabulary has changed so much since I was a kid. It really has. I mean, we used to cook in a pot. Uh, you, you um, sweet had calories. And when you pulled out, that was a dental procedure. <laughs> and beating around the bush was not a political statement and it had nothing to do with my crotch. <laughs> and speaking of my crotch, yes. all you girls want Brazilians. Well, I've got great news for you. If you wait long enough, you won't need one. And, and thank you very much, I'm Lynn Ruth Miller.